Hey, what's going on everyone? RC84 here, like always, thanks for watching. Well, my friends, welcome back to the HG Humvee, the P408. And in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to lock the differentials on this truck. It's one of the features of this truck. It has open and locking differentials. Now, you cannot lock and unlock the differentials through the controller like a Traxxas TR4. That would have been really nice if they incorporated it with the truck, but they did not. So you have to do this by hand or manually, you have to do it. And it's very easy to do, very simple, and takes no time to really to do. Now, HG does send you the tools to lock differentials. So I'm gonna show you that, and we're gonna go over some of the tools that you're gonna need to do this, all right? So let's get to it. All right, so here is some of the tools and hardware that you're gonna need to lock the differentials. So first off, you're gonna need a pair of needle nose pliers. I'll tell you the reason why, it, why you need these in a little bit. Also, you're going to need a 1.5 millimeter hex screwdriver, which is the same screwdriver that is included with the truck. So you got that already covered. Also, you want to have a flashlight to see down into the differential cover there. You don't have to have one, but I would kind of recommend it. And also, you want to get your parts bag out because the truck comes with a bunch of spare parts. And in this bag are two little 1.5 millimeter grub screws if you can see that not exactly sure try to show it to you guys there you go all right so you got to use those to lock up the differential now you're probably saying do you need the monster energy drink yeah you don't need it but it does does help and uh especially when you're filming and working on your rc's late at night it's definitely nice to have a little bit of some energy so you can work on it so to lock the differentials, there are two little covers, one on the front and one on the rear of the differentials. And we got to pull those little covers off, put these screws down into the hole, and that will lock up our differentials so we can be able to have full time full drive instead of open differentials. So let's go ahead and get started with that. All right, everyone, so I flipped the truck upside down. This makes it a lot easier to get to those differentials versus the truck being on its wheels or on a, or on a work stand with it moving around and stuff. This makes it a lot easier to get those differentials. Now, I also have this nice little foam pad down here to protect the body shell while I'm working on it so it doesn't get scratched or anything like that. All right, so our differentials are located here. It's our front differential and our rear differential in the back, of course. Now on these differentials, you're going to have these little hook pegs that's right next to the differential cover itself. And this is your access point to where you take that growth screw and you slide down into locking your differential. So you're going to need a pair of needle nose pliers, like I said, and what you want to do is that you want to get there, you want to clamp down onto it, and you want to give this thing a good pull because they are actually in there very, very well. So you gotta really pull them out. So you wanna take your hand and grab the back of the, the chassis right here. You wanna grab the chassis right here by the servo behind your wheels, and that way hold it in place, and then take your pliers and give it a good pull. You might wanna wiggle it around a little bit, maybe that might help. And as you see, a lot of force there to pull these little pegs out. So they're in there pretty good. So yeah, now you also, have extra ones of these in your hardware kit right there. I almost knocked my drink over. <laughs> so you got extra ones of these in there so that way you can uh, have backups in case you do lose it. All right, so there is our access point right there to get the grub screw in. Now you can do this two ways. You can uh, line the hole up with the grub hole or your you can line up your differential to the hole so you can slide that grub screw in, or you can just take your grub screw, put it onto your screwdriver here, slide it in, and just kind of turn the wheels around a little bit until it slides into the differential hole cover there, and that will lock it in place. So you screw it in, and you'll have locking differentials. So you wanna do the same as you did with the front, with the rear it's the same process same thing nothing different on that fact right there so once you do the front you can do the rear no problem or you can do the rear do the front whatever you side you want to do but uh yeah 
So that's how you lock the differentials in the HG Humvee P408. So there you go, my friends. So hopefully this helped you out. If it did, click that like button, subscribe to the channel. If you have not, uh, please do. <laughs> and if you got any questions, concerns, uh, just comment down below. I'd be happy to answer any of y'all's questions. So my friends, I'll be seeing y'all out soon with the HG Humvee. All right, well, see y'all later.